Welcome to Freshly Flanimated. Now here we have these two poses. I will create a classic twin. I will hide the effectors for a while. And I will show you another problem. Now, normally, because this is CS, we don't have uh, layer parenting here, so we'll have to clean these using the classic cleanup. I'll make a selection and I'll go Alt plus Q, and we have all these extra keyframes that clean up the movement. I'll do the same for this arm. Okay. So these are cleaned up, but what about the legs? Now the legs, I can attempt to clean up with a forward kinematic cleanup, and then this is what you get. You get undesired results. I'll remove these and show you how IK cleanup works. So by selecting one of the effectors, I will trigger IK cleanup from the Smart Magnetry Helpers panel. It's this button here. When I press it, we get a different result to what we got when we did the forward kinematic cleanup. You can see that the IK chains have now been solved. The foot stays in place and the legs were cleaned up the way they are supposed to move. I'll do the same for the other effector. So there we go. We cleaned up the arms in a forward kinematics manner and we cleaned up the legs in an IK manner. Now let me just for the sake of this demonstration remove the cleanup from this arm here to see what will happen if we choose this effector and clean the arm in an IK manner. We get a different type of movement. Now this time, the forward kinematic cleans up along an arc. Let me just show you the movement. Now the forward kinematic cleans up the arm movement along an arc, while the IK cleans up this point in a straight line and then it just solved all the IK chains in between the two keys. So we got a completely different type of movement. The in-betweens are different even though the keys are the same. Freshly Flanimated. animated.